<laughs> Alright guys, I'm um, back. Um, so here's where we left off. Basically we're just going to add the um, mm, the path to MinGW to the bin folder. So Windows knows where it's at, uh, the GDB is at. So what we're going to do is click on environment uh, variables and go ahead and scroll down uh, to your path variable here and uh, edit. And what we're going to do is just add it to the end. And so basically, all I added was this line of text. Make sure not to leave spaces. And um, go ahead and put the semicolon. So it's going to be semicolon C colon backslash minjw backslash bin. And so now the path is set up, basically. Okay, and then we go, okay, okay this. So we're okay good here now. Um, and now we're going to do somewhat the similar thing to Eclipse. And I'll close this off. Close this. So Eclipse. Okay. So I'll go ahead and open a new C++ project. Call it test I believe. one with the project. Go ahead and go to next. And go ahead and go to advanced settings. And then we're gonna go to C build and here in environment. If you don't have this variable, go ahead and add this variable. And what you want to add, or make sure the value has, is um, the same thing we just did with the Windows uh, computer. Um, you want to add this path to it. So um, it basically go ahead and grabs the GDB and the uh, G++. Okay. So we have that. Make sure that's applied. Okay. And go ahead and finish. All right, guys. So uh, once you build your project, um, basically I have one here. What you want to do is add a breakpoint to your main. So once you build it and you want to say you want to go ahead and debug it, go ahead and add a breakpoint there. And there's some, there seems to be a bug um, that I haven't been able to fix. And if you, any of you guys are able to fix it, go ahead and uh, post it as a reply, as a comment. However, go ahead. Um, there seems if you don't add the breakpoint, um, the debugger doesn't work properly and basically you're, you, you aren't able to step through your program. So once you add that breakpoint um, and you start the debugger, it should stop there. So I'll show there. So basically there, it stopped at the breakpoint. Now I'm basically able to step through my, pro my program step by step and just make sure and watch the variables and everything. So um, I think that's it. And uh, if you guys have any other questions, please post them. Um, and I'll try to answer them. And I'll go ahead and uh, and post the the uh, the links should be up to the MinGW, the GDB. And I'll also post a link to the, um, the C++ version of Eclipse. And that way you guys can just click and download. All right. Uh, thanks for watching, guys, and I uh, hope I helped to solve your problem. This took me a while to solve, so I hope I made it uh, the solution a lot easier for you guys. Okay. I'll see you guys soon. Bye bye.